Army, it's great to see you again. What's up, dude? You made me the biggest rock star in my mom's eyes at the Critics' Choice Awards last year. Okay. I'm walking out with my mom. Yeah. You know, I'm my mama's boy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's always my date at the award shows. Yeah. You're walking out, you saw me, and you went, dude, Oh, uh, that, I remember that, actually. I remember seeing you there. That, oh, that's great. Well, tell your mom I said hi. I will. Thank you for yeah. that, Army. Thank you for everything, and thank you for this film. Uh, what is the responsibility as an actor to get something right when you're playing a true person? You know, I mean, that's that's probably a, a better question for Felicity, because she's playing someone who is so immediately recognizable. I mean, Ruth Bader Ginsburg has been in the public sphere and in, in the public eye for so long that for her to get her mannerisms right, her walk right, her talk right, all those things about her is probably more important than Martin because he also really preferred to stay behind the scenes. That being said, Felicity nailed it, and for me it was more about just getting the essence of who he was, his, his charm, his sweetness, the fact that he was such an incredible husband, father, uh, such a supportive partner, all that stuff. I just wanted to nail that stuff. That was my second question. You know, yeah. what was so unique about their relationship? I mean, this was many, many years ago yeah. where women were kind of, you you know, not at the forefront, but she was a go-getter, which I'm glad she still is. Yeah. But what was, is that part of the unique, part of their relationship? Yeah, I think the thing that makes their relationship unique and really progressive for the time, I mean, shit, dude, it's progressive for now, yeah. but, but the fact that they actually had and existed in a place of completely equal partnership. And that's something that we still haven't been able to achieve in, in the American workforce and in, in any other real way when it comes to gender equality, but they had it. And it's... It's a further way that she's an example to be looked up to, she and her relationship with Marty. What was most important for you uh, to portray? Uh, I wanted to get how sweet he was, I wanted to get how supportive he was, and I wanted to get that he was a good cook. <laughs> I like that. Yeah. All right, holiday season is here, and um, we're putting together a little special of every, what everybody wants for Christmas, holiday traditions. Yeah. What does Army Hammer want for Christmas this year? Ooh, all right. Well, for those in Houston and, and all around the great state of Texas and anywhere else, only Bird Bakery goods. That's all you need to buy. T-shirts, mugs, cookies, pies, cupcakes, whatever you want to buy, just get it from Bird Bakery. <laughs> that's right. Yeah, that's right. That's absolutely right. I yeah. like that. And there we're going to air that because it's... Shameless plug. No, dude, I, I freaking love that you did that. Yeah. Uh, what are your plans for the holidays? Just kind of mellow out? Yeah, we're going to go to the bakery. Of, uh, the one in Dallas will be there before Christmas. Then we're going to go spend Christmas with my in-laws in Denver, and then we're going to go see my my dad and his wife down in the Cayman Islands.